Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetStudio.com, and today we are going to highlight the navigation capabilities of the Nokia Asha 501. Nokia Asha 501 is the latest Asha series phone, and it is the most different Asha series phone which you have seen till now. In terms of the user interface, it has a different kind of user interface, which is called Nokia Asha Software Platform 1.0, which is running on this device as far as the operating system is concerned. And also in terms of the UI, it has a very different kind of a UI. And some of our readers were actually asking whether we can actually use this device for navigation or not. And to answer this question, yes, you can use Nokia Asha 501 for navigation purpose as well, especially whenever you are on the go. And again, it won't work with the help of GPS because it does not have a GPS chip inside but it can work with the help of assisted GPS with the help of network uh, triangulation as per which in which there are some cell phone towers which will allow you to specify or point out the location where you are with this phone and you can actually use that information for navigation and in this case what you need to do is first of all you need to install the Nokia Hair Maps so for that you need to go to the store up in here you need to search for Nokia hair maps so you need to write hair maps under the search criteria and then you need to and then to locate the hair maps which is a beta application for this device and again you can get this application on this device for free by tapping over here so once the hair maps are downloaded you will see a new icon under all applications and then you can launch the hair maps from here Again the application is not very fast and now in order to locate your position uh, wherever you are you need to first of all have a Wi-Fi connection that means you need to have internet connection on this device either in the form of a Wi-Fi connection or in the form of 2G and also you need to have a SIM card inserted into, into the device because it will actually try to get your location with the help of network triangulation and that won't happen only with Wi-Fi. So if you have internet connectivity on this device and you are trying to use GPS navigation, it won't work. Make sure you have a SIM card inside this device, either in the SIM card slot or the two slot and then you will be able to locate your position. So as you can see it has located our position and it is again an approximate location, not the exact location which it has located but uh, as per the information which it is giving right now. We are almost nearby to the location where it is actually pointing. Again under the hair maps application you can always revert the different kind of maps modes. You can always go for the satellite options as well so that you can see more information. You can uh, go for the public transport mode in which it will show you the routes and the roads where the traffic is low or high as per the information it has fetched from the Nokia hair map servers and you can also turn it to the traffic mode as well over here as you can see so under the traffic mode it will actually show you the roads where the traffic is low it will also let you know with the red color where the traffic is high on those roads and you also have this option of public transport it will in which it will actually show you where you can actually take public transport on which roads and what kind of public transport is actually available mode is the map mode in case you want to use this device for navigation and once you have done that once you have located your location you can search for any address for example let me search for India gate as of now so as you can see it has located India gate over here and it can also show you the photos of that particular place in case you want to confirm and once you have searched for a particular address you can always route now for after searching for this particular address you can always create a route from your location to that particular location which so now you can select the starting position that is from and you can pick it from the map so the map will fetch the location where, wherever you are and then you can go to the second location so we have specified the start and the end location and now we can get the directions as per walking for bus as well as for the car so let's try to get the route now. So the Nokia hair map does work on the Nokia Asha 501 in case you want to use this device for navigation. It won't be very precise, precise in terms of the overall location but still it will work and you can use navigation on this device on the go with the help of internet connection in the form of 2G and 
you need to have a cellular SIM card inside this device before you can actually use GPS navigation on this device. One more thing I would like to tell you is that you do not have Google Maps application as of now available for this device. That's all from us. Thanks for watching this video. Do let us know if you have any specific question for this device. We would love to help you. You can like this video if this video helped you by clicking the like button below. You can subscribe to our YouTube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching this video. This is Abhishek signing off. Thank you.